Hello, hello, hello. Alright, my mic is working. Everything's good. Um, alright, originally I was going to stream all of Shadowbringers. I didn't. Uh, mostly because of internet issues, but also because of, uh, being anxious. Not that anyone's watching me, so I shouldn't be anxious, but, like, uh, you know. I don't want someone to show up to, like, a subpar stream and be like, Oh, man, this guy is trash. And I'd be like, yeah, I know. Anyway, whatever. Said you show up to a subpar video and, uh, the same thing happened. And, uh, you know, I'm wasting my time. To be fair, it's not like you know if this is streamed, because I technically have my notifications on and stuff. So, I don't know. Alright, sorry. Shut up now. Well, no, I'm not gonna shut up. No, I have to forget this is the point of the whole thing. Damn it. Alright. So. I got to the quest titled Shadowbringers. And I figured, hey, I'd record my reaction to this because it's probably important and emotional and I might cry. You know, I might not, to be fair, because I'm on camera. So my uh, emotional stability may be increased a bit. But, you know, we'll see. I already talked to Alize, so if you're wondering why she's not here, that's why. But, you know, let's, let's do it. Lothry spoke of the disaster we would bring upon our own heads, the ceaseless conflict. Imagine how he would sneer to see what's become of the first, and imagine your perilous predicament. And who can deny the, fire, the fire your deeds have ignited in people's hearts? You achieved what my logic and ideals never could, a uniting disparate peoples, a banner of hope and common purpose. Without you, that giant Talos would never have raised its head. I have borne witness to many such miracles at your side, and would do so again. This is but another obstacle on the road. So come, let us travel it. Drag me through wonder and danger as you are wont to do, and I shall endeavor not to slow you down. Sorry, I have... As well thou knowest, if we are to usher Emmet Selk unto his rest, we must needs bind his Asian soul, and then shatter it with overwhelming force. A former task requireth our sight, and, I, and such have I prepared upon the exarch's asking no less, though twas ever mine intent to provide said boon. Future whence our noble friend doth hail is a world fallen to Asian artifice. He would not see such a grim history repeated. In a sense, Emek Selk's destruction will be the culmination of the Exert's efforts, a reward for all he hath endured these many years. Yet even as thou stridest into the jaws of peril, forget not but that his fondest wish, and that of his many others besides, is to see thee survive unto the morrow. Tis in pursuit of that happiest of outcomes that I do pledge to remain at thy side. You, Rianger. Uh, most relatable character we've ever had. Our time in the first has been a never-ending succession of trials arduous as our path and source ever was. Yet, through all our journeys together, through that deep and foreboding wood, you have helped me to stay true to my convictions. Thus would I return the favor, do as your heart decrees, without hesitation or regret. All... Oh, sorry. And that is all I will say on the matter. I'm good at reading, I promise. It's just hard to read out loud for uh, extended periods of time. Well, this has put everyone in a solemn mood, hasn't it? Honestly, we're not even sure this will be the end of it. But I suppose we should speak our minds when we have the opportunity. You taught me that much in Amarang. Forgive me this moment of sentiment, Lana. By dragging me into this sorry mess, you've given me the chance to think and act as I should have. For Ryan's sake. For Reen's sake, actually. I'd freaking always say Ryan, because I'm a Xenoblade fan anyway. Uh, Words cannot express how much this has changed my life or how grateful I am for your support. So I shall express my gratitude through action instead, and no matter where you decide to go, I will be there guarding your back. Thanks, Sacred. Oh, now we get the cutscene. Gonna be voice acted? Oh. 
When Menphilia entrusted me with her power, she warned me that no matter how strong you become, you can still fall victim to despair, you can still feel powerless. And she was right. After you collapsed on Mount Golg, my hands wouldn't stop shaking. I made a mistake. If I failed to bind the light within you, I was terrified you would die. Even now, you could be moments from turning and I wouldn't know how to save you. You, Thonkrit, the others, you've all been there when I needed help. Menphilia surrendered her life to me, her legacy. I should be ready to do the same for you, and I want to. I do, but I just... Not good enough. You told me to follow your example, and I've tried. I've really tried. Asking to save. The light, it, you'll, how can you go on? I don't know, I'll probably explode or something. YOLO, right? Oh, hell yeah. A smile better suits a hero. My sweet summer child. Not sure I... I never mind. I think I'll understand better if I try it for myself. No, nothing will come of brooding here in self-pity. I've made my decision. I know, I'm going with you. Alright. I suppose, since uh, this is confirmed, not a stream, and I am recording it, I'll just blow my nose and uh, cut it out, and that would be great, but I'll kind of invest in it. Okay, hold on. Give me two seconds. Alright, probably cut that out. I hope. Oh, now it's gonna make me sneeze because I blew my nose. It's okay. Stay strong. Uh, should I do, like, voices? I mean, I've been kind of doing voices the whole time, so I might as well keep going. Welcome to the capital. All visitors must present an official writ of permission. This will be granted. Your documents appear to be in order. Proceed into the capital. Any guests you may choose to bring with you must remain in the vicinity at all times. Also, for story's sake, if there's like a dungeon here, I'll probably just do the trust thing instead of inviting members of my FC. This really is unacceptable. I gave you very specific instructions. Let's do this. Uh. Okay. Emma <laughs> Falk. My invitation was for Let's an abomination my head. ripe with the power to bring about the world's annihilation. Not this half-broken... thing. Whatever am I to do with you? And I see you insist on keeping the same familiar company. Are you so lost without them? It is not she who is lost without the familiar. Not content with remaking an entire city, you aim to fill it with the reconstituted souls of the dead. I may have gotten a little carried away in my attention to detail. Added a few unnecessary flourishes. Okay. Well, there's no point trying to hide it. Yes. 
Once the rejoining of worlds is complete, Zodiac will regain his full strength and shatter his prison. Then we shall offer up the Source's remaining inhabitants in sacrifice, that we might resurrect our brethren who died to bring Zodiac into existence. But what was it that you came here to do exactly? Gee, now I don't know. Came here or the eggs are. Well, you can't have him. The wisdom that man guards may open up new worlds of possibilities. He has unlocked the secrets of travel across the rift and through time as well, it would seem. Quite an accomplishment for one of his incomplete nature. I must explore the limits of his capabilities and harness that power for the ardor. No one is pleased with this Even explanation. Now, after everything, you refuse to see reason. You think it unfair that you were subject to suffering? That your lives will be sacrificed for the ancients? Look at me. I have lived a thousand, thousand of your lives. I have broken bread with you. Fought with you, grown ill, grown old, sired children, and yes, welcomed death's sweet embrace. When For did you die? Have I measured your worth and found you wanting? Too weak and feeble minded to serve the stewards of any star. Your recent spats with Vorthri and his sin eaters taught you nothing. Have Perhaps. you not learned that your ignorance and frailty beget only endless misery? How long do you mean to perpetuate this farce? How much more must I endure your bumbling interference? Let us imagine that the laws of reality are again undone and the world faces true annihilation. Do you honestly believe that half your number would sacrifice themselves to save the other? Of course they wouldn't! And if you had witnessed history unfold as I had, you would reach the same conclusion. You cannot be entrusted with our legacy. I will bring back our brethren, our friends, our loved ones. The world belongs to us and us alone. I mean, it's not like I disagree necessarily, to be fair. Like, I feel like Emmett Silk has some, you know, knowledge. That perhaps our characters don't a hundred percent understand. Or maybe they just don't care. Maybe Alpha knows about to drop some interesting, like, seventh dimensional truth bomb right here. Emmett Silk! We understand, truly, but it makes no difference. The ones you love are in the past. While ours are here in the present. One day, we too will be ashes and dust. But not today. Our time is not yet finished. We share your conviction. And that is why we will not abandon our course.
You think us the same? You think your tattered soul of equal worth to those I lost? Then come. Earn your place. Prove yourselves worthy to inherit this star. Why do you just have a room with fire in it? You can hear the dialogue. A little low. Granted, you've probably seen this before. Maybe it's not as important to you. And that's totally okay. I'm supposed to walk in there now? Amarat. Isn't he the, uh, like, fringe party member from Final Fantasy IX? But whatever. Alright, uh, something I do every time I play this game on camera. The random minion! Wow, okay, we've got a kobold or nice. Okay. Um... Who are we bringing? Alright, we're tanking. So we want a healer. Do you take Uriange or Alpha? No. I suppose if I talk to... I could do small talk. Alright, let's do that. Say the word. However harrowing the scenes that await us, they will not sway us from our course. I won't ask you to hold back. That time is long past. I'll just have to snuff out the worst of the embers before they reach you. I reasoned that Emmett Selk would not harm the Exarch until he had learned the Tower's secrets, but his parting words suggest otherwise. Let's make haste. Your friend may not have the luxury of decades to wait for you this time. I can feel it beyond the flames, a darkness waiting to swallow our light. Wherever you are, Menphilia, watch over us and guide our steps. I think she's gone, man. How fast. Ready when you are, Lana. If it's proof he wants, we'll give him a fight the lights and see he's never seen. In those final days, tis said that, a mo that monstrous beasts were set loose in the city, tearing my flesh by sorcerers run rampant. That Silk had been faithful to his reconstruction, we must be prepared to face such many abominations. How many worlds was the original world split up into? 14, right? Because it's Final Fantasy 14, so they have to, like, make a reference to the number for some reason. So, one would gather that a party of 14 people would be equal to that of one person in the past? Or something like that, anyway. Alright, who are we taking? It recommends Ishtola, Alize, and Alphano. Honestly, I'm not opposed. I could DPS though. By DPS, I'm less likely to throw. Yeah, but no, I have to be. I have to be a Dark Knight for the, the lore. Uh, you know what? Let's take Ring. And I guess we're kind of running a babysitting service now, but whatever, it's fine. I have a feeling that Rain is not going to be with us in the next expansion. I have no idea how this ends, but figure might as well make use of her while we have the opportunity. While Alpha though and Alize will likely uh you know, be there all the time. Um, 
they're like the main characters other than us, and they probably have more interesting things to say than Uriange, and no offense to Uriange. Welcome to the final days of Amorant. Alright, let's go. My eye level's been synced to 440. Oh, good. Good thing my eye level's, um... Not close to that at all. The fabric of our star began to fray, and the unchecked energies of creation begat malformed beasts. Um, I'm pretty sure I remember how to play this class. You know, feel free to judge my uh, tanking skills anyway. I have to AoE harder so that things don't attack out. I don't have tank stance on. Well, that's fine. The NPCs are broken, so they'll just carry me. Easy. <laughs> Easy flex. Uh, damage resistance? Thank you. Alright, I guess the Terminus Detonator uh, doesn't give a shit about aggro. I, you know, I'm kind of glad I'm doing this with uh, these guys and not real people, because uh, they'll love me no matter what. <laughs> well, maybe it's teaching me bad habits, I don't know. Uh, let's not stand in the AoEs, how is it? No, not the flame you or anything, but the... Uh... Stop. <laughs> My mana is not surviving the uh, trip into Amarant or Amarat or yeah. No, Amaranth is the bad, like, the edgelord from Final Fantasy IX. Amarat is something else. That seems familiar, though. I'm pretty sure it is something. Baliak, protect me. I don't even know who that is. Assume he's one of the twelve. No, it's kind of strange. They're referred to the, the 12 gods of uh, Eorzea or whatever. I don't think a single one of them is ever, like, actually brought up in lore. Like, I, don't, I know nothing about them. You know, for them to be so important. It's kind of just like, oh, you know, Hydaelyn's actually the real god, and the other ones are just fake primals, even though Hydaelyn's also just a fake primal. Also, if you're watching this and you're like, oh man, spoilers, bro, uh, why are you watching, <laughs> why are you watching this? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, man. You know, I, I might cut out some of the combat, maybe. I guess one of the upsides of it being a video. Uh, stop uh, on aggro. Thanks. No, no need to just get hit by AOEs. And my eye level sucks. Which is weird because I'm using the gear they give you at 80. I mean, maybe it's not weird that my eye level sucks because I'm using that gear, but you know, they could have at least given me like an eye level 430 belt. They did. No. He's dead. Bro, I don't know. Like, no offense to Emmett Selk, but his, like, people are kinda losers. 
Like, oh no, nah, dude, we all gotta dress the same and talk the same and act the same because, like, that's the only reasonable thing to do in a future society where uh, people are worried about equality at any time and every time. It's like, wow, that's, uh, it sounds awful to me, but hey. Not saying MXL's uh, people deserve to die, but they probably deserve to die. Granted, that doesn't mean I don't understand his position and sympathize with him, because I do. I do sympathize with MXL, but, uh... I mean, to destroy 14 worlds to get, like, one New York City bank with a bunch of, like, losers who stood around and did nothing all day? I don't know, man. Just as prayer gives rise to prideals, our dread may manifest our deepest fears. Ew. This thing's hideous. Alright, Alizé, get ready to punch it. People who aren't me have to not get hit by AoEs. You know, that works. Wait. <laughs> Wait. Ow. Uh, everyone get behind the rock? I, I hope this works. But, you know, just in case. <laughs> just in case we're getting a shadow wall there. out of it. Oh, that's an insta-kill! Okay, I'm gonna edit out me walking back. Alright, in my defense, it's really hard to see anything in this game. There's so many freaking particle effects. move again. Y'all wanna be here. Right, I'm gonna hide behind this rock. That way I don't get killed by his next move. I guess that's not how that's gonna work, huh? Oh no, it is. Okay, I used the wrong move on accident. You know, that's okay. Don't do that. Gonna win the play? No, I guess. Might as well. Okay. Good, good, good kitty. Oh, this thing's really annoying. I mean, alright, look. 
I would be upset if the game didn't get harder uh, the more you played it. Oh shit. Uh, you know, I'm not gonna complain about difficulty. You, you know, you might think you see it coming. Like, oh man, it's gonna be like, oh, the game's too hard. No. Wrong. Look, when it comes to MMOs and difficulty, it's either mathematically impossible or you're just bad. And I know you're like, wow, that's not a fair middle ground, but you know, it kinda is. <laughs> It's kind of like RPGs in a way. I mean, it is an RPG, right? So it would make sense that it's like RPGs. <laughs> uh, no. Wasted the uh, blood weapon there. I did. But that's okay. Don't have to worry about the flaming of my teammates. Just the flaming of uh, my friends in the comment section, but that's alright. Dude, we got bracelets. Hold on, let's put those on. Huh? Oh, there's no way that bracelet isn't better, right? Where is it? <laughs> Right here. Oh. I can't wear it. Alright, well, you know, we'll find the gear along the way, I hope. Oops. Hit the wrong button. This is why you shouldn't be a button clicker. Um, it's bad for you. Alright, I should be able to pull this much. I mean, alright, maybe I can't? I should be able to. Anyway. Alright, I was wrong. <laughs> uh, help. Alphano? Alphano? I know that thing is hitting you, but you're gonna have to save me. Uh, die? Die? Uh, die. Uh, run? Alpha no, I swear to God. Just ignore the thing? <laughs> it's really not that scary. Alright, one of the enemies died, so... We should be able to tank now. Look, I, low item level is low. What do you want from me? It doesn't help when your uh, healer is fighting an enemy. I mean, I guess I might as well. 
as well use Blackest Knight. Let's let the DPS do damage. Sorry, with the healer do damage. The city's burned. The waters ran red with blood. Why did this happen? Perhaps I missed something. Yo, that thing is sick. I mean, there's an assumption, right? Like, there was ancient people that were really powerful or something, but they got killed. And, you know, he's out here like Heidelin's the enemy, fam, but is she? Like, obviously something else happened here. Responding to a FC. Yeah, I, I don't know. Like, what? What decided to destroy your world? And maybe they had a good reason. Maybe your world was evil. Maybe you were evil. And these things are, these horrible, like, nightmare monstrosities are actually, like, space cops? Uh, from space? And, you know, they're just trying to stop you from, uh, being a dick. You know, maybe I'm, uh, very far off the mark, but, you know, I don't know better. Yeah, I've been, uh, I've been sitting on this mission for a little while, just because I wanted to make sure I could record it, but, um, you know. <laughs> I'm sure a lot of this, uh, video is gonna be me saying nothing, because, uh, I'm doing combat, and I don't want to get killed by bad pulls, even though Alphano's broken, I, like, I'm pretty sure the NPCs have an eye level of, like, 700, even though, uh, it's so evil. Alright, maybe not, because then the DPS would actually do something. Ring offending? Alright, alright. Eye level. Went up by two. Two whole eye levels? That's pretty good. Okay, there's a chicken. Goblin? Literally, it's literally a dodo with a goblin head. Things kind of funny looking. I like it. Oh, okay. I'm sorry, Alize. I didn't know that they did something to you. Not wrong. Maybe. Whatever. It's fine that I use the move because the right move wasn't even up. I use Wait, what? I just have to pull? That's the boss? Um, I don't know because I'm playing with NPCs and I can't have uh, teammates to yell at me and say that I'm doing things wrong. But should I be getting the bombs off of my uh, healers and DPSs? Or should I be pulling the enemies away from the bombs and letting them deal with the bombs. I don't know. 
you know, perhaps it's a dumb question overall. Now seems relevant, at least. Also, something worth noting, I guess, is they don't have mana. Do ninjas even use mana? I don't know. Most, well, a lot of classes don't. Uh, tanks use mana. For whatever reason. Uh, come on out, Shadow. Give me, give me a hand here. Try not to move around too much, because Rain's a rogue and I know she has positionals, but... I don't even know if she's using them. <laughs> Maybe I should just be more worried about not getting hit by AoEs. Alright, what the fuck is this? Uh, holy shit. Uh, why? Is there 700 enemies? What's, what's going on here? Working out a bit. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not doing bad. Something Dark Knight uh, has is AoE. Something uh, I don't have is uh, literally any vision of what's going on. You have three Vuln stacks though, that seems pretty bad. Glad, um, Alpha no like heals you to full with one galvanize. Yo, the chicken's back. Okay, it's gonna explode. Oh, we have to DPS it. Oh, oh, oh no. Uh, yo, yo, hold on, hold on, we got this, hold on. Uh, use everything? <laughs> okay, we live. This is far from the worst of it. Come, and I will show you. Yo, don't, <laughs> uh, don't show me? Who's saying stuff? Alrighty. Just a little further. And you will see the end of a world. Are we in space? Also, where's the moon? It's neither claw nor flame, but our very sins. What the frick is that? We playing Bayonetta out here? No! Hold on, I gotta blow my nose. Hopefully this thing doesn't kill me when I'm doing it. Uh, cut this out. Alright. No. No killing me allowed.
Okay. Uh, easy. Made it out of that pole with uh, no issues. Well, you know, none for me anyway. Whatever Alpha No has to do is Alpha No's problem. What red mage skill is that? It's like that one AoE skill? Uh, but it isn't. <laughs> Perhaps it was like Verholi or something and I just didn't notice. What is that? It's disgusting. Is what it is. No, 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 no. Get off of Alpha. Alright. Some reprisal. You know what? I can actually, like, use Rampart for every pull because enemies are so tanky now. Jeez Louise. Alright, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna kill this. I don't really know what the right thing to do is, but I'm just gonna assume it's kill this. That's what I've decided. Uh, boom. 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 Bottom. Bottom there. Oh, it's probably Verflare. Maybe. I think Verflare looks different. The star was fading. Is it the thing that is neither of them? that you get after you use both of them. No, that's not very descriptive, but uh, it's what you get, because I haven't gotten level 80 red mage yet. You know, close. But I've heard Bosja is a good place for uh, leveling. So, I'm gonna wait on leveling classes to 80 until I get the boss job. Well, you know, more than I already have. I already have White Mage and Bard up to 80 as well as... Uh... Where's Thaliac again? Gonna guess the appearance. Man, a freaking Dark Knight does no damage. <laughs> Apparently, Warrior's damage was very similar to Dark Knight's before the most recent patch, and for that I am like, wow, sorry, Warriors. I, I didn't know. I didn't know you were so bad. <laughs> This thing is so unbelievably tanky, you just die. Are we fighting this thing now? Or is it just still gonna shoot lasers at us? Want the treasure. Slaying? No, I need fending. Stop.
Perhaps the NPCs are holding back their damage. So that, uh, they don't pull aggro from me? I don't think that's true. Because they're pulling aggro. would be funny if they were intentionally doing worse because uh, my item level is so bad. But between us and our goal, bloom a final misbegotten feed. A final misbegotten feed. This freaking thing? They keep shooting lasers at us? Thonic Riddle? Therion? Gotta be honest, I have no idea what this is. The power of editing is on my side. Okay. I mean, I'm just gonna kick its ass, right? I can fight. I've made my choice. Bro, how do you even fight this thing? It's enormous. get hit by that? Holy shit. <laughs> uh oh. Uh, run away! Ouch. Well, I'm fine. <laughs> boop, 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 boop. Still fine. Honestly, uh, not even close, to be honest. Just get some MP. Don't do this. Don't use Apocalypsis on me. Don't pretend to assume you understand what you're doing. Uh, run. Uh, run away. Maybe you should have started running away instead of dying out and out. Sorry. Alright. Oh, Shit, Alpha No died. Yo, where's Vereza? Alright, we're back. Uh, let's do that. Maybe maybe Alpha Nome will be less averse to dying. Definitely right. There's a user. I don't know if we're doing enough damage, to be honest. Maybe we are. I don't know. Seem like we are. Shadow Wreck? I don't know what Shadow Wreck is, but I'm just gonna take it. Got 
Yeah, I hope so. Leave, leave this man a smoking crater, Eliza. We need it. We're not exactly in the best position here. I do kind of hope they add a sub- like, I don't know. I don't necessarily think this game needs new jobs, but like a sub job system would be kind of cool. Because, like, I like the idea of being a rogue. I'm not a huge fan of the idea of being a ninja, I gotta be honest. And, like, you know, I love the idea of being, like, an ice mage. And, but, like, black mage has the ice spells, and I don't really want to, like, be a fire mage. Maybe I'm out of my mind. I don't even know why I brought that up there. Oh, because of Reen and her backflips and stuff. And I was like, wow, I, I want to play that class that I can't play because it's not real. So that fight was cool. Uh, you know, alpha no carry and all that. All that jazz. Uh, belt of maiming? Alright. Can I not wear it? I can't. It's for Dragoon only. Thank you. Okay. Guessing there's gonna be some cutscenes here. This I mean, skybox is beautiful. But that's, like, kind of a given. What do you want? Well, well, you prevailed. Of course I did. Did you see those lustroids? We're critting for, like, 70 billion Nevertheless. I'm fine. Your performance was underwhelming, and I remain unconvinced of your words. Oh, you tower of your misbegotten ilk, no doubt. But should I bring my full strength to bear, well, you would be as leaves in the wind. The gulf between us is a reflection of the disparity between the world as it was and what it has become. But can't we, like, make it how it has become in a better way? Uh, our world may not live up to your lofty standards. But they are our worlds, our homes, full of life and love and hope. I think I need to turn this up a little bit. Stand by and let you destroy them. Well, now it's kind of a bad time. Alize! You are a mistake. For we well, I just say it. The shattered source and these shards are ghastly mockeries of the true world. The ephemeral lives you exalt are pale imitations, utterly devoid of meaning. Belittle us all you like. But we will rise again and again 
and give the lie to your insults through word and deed. We define our worth, not the circumstances of our creation. <laughs> More prick. I mean, in itself, it would be brattle, yes. Oh god, they're dead! But I saw them in the Endwalker cut cinematic, so I know they're not. Fool. Who are you? No one. Nothing. Once I have reclaimed my heritage, my first act will be to expunge your stain from history's weave. Rude. My world will have no need for heroes. Hey, I'm at least uh, one seventh of a person. I'll have you know, Emmett Belch. Still fighting the good fight. It is true that all we hold dear is fated to fade away. Just that is quick no as you know, glossy. To take what steps we may, and thus mark the road for those who would follow. To strive for the best of all futures. Be this not also thy purpose? Right in the gut. You don't even think of the future, though. You're just thinking of the past. And you, why waste your final moments in futile defiance? What makes you think that a bunch of people want to no be resurrected from the dead? Fight, no life left to live. Oh, hey, it's that uh, rat from the cinematic. No fight left to fight, no life left to live. It's not a rat. I might as well explode here if I'm gonna Surrender explode anyway. Surrender to your fate, and let the transformation take you. Rise up in madness and fury. Devour the vermin infesting the land which is rightfully ours. What land? Anchor? Tis turn to be cool? Get very far, gotta be honest. Just vomiting up light, don't worry about me. Yo, our bird, how's it going? If you had the strength to take another step, could you do it? Could you save our worlds?
What? All by myself? Yo, I don't know what this is, but it's really cool. Shadowbringers theme? Aw, dude. This world is not yours to end. This is our future. Our story. Yeah, that's right. I'm one seventh of a person. Kind of. If I'm understanding the lore correctly. How did you get here? Oh shit. Wait, is he summoning my other me's? It ends this day. One way or another, it ends. Very well. Let us proceed to your final judgment. Yo. Oh, it's so cool. And the vanquished become its villain. Fair enough. You're an assy and all the same. And you'll die like the rest. Yo. Wait. Do I have to do this one by myself? <laughs> oh, dude. There's seven? So there's only nine of me. So I'm missing five of me? Is that how that works? No. Alright, hold on. I'm gonna cut out the queue time. Also? Do I want to do this as a tank? And have a bunch of people hate me. Uh, I'm thinking. Yes. <laughs> yes, I do want to do this as a tank. I shouldn't need to. Invite... I shouldn't need to invite people to this either. It'll be a fast queue. We'll see.
Okay. Uh, let's go. Hopefully I'll have cut all of that, uh, queue time out. It's only like five minutes, it's supposed to not that. Well, I mean, you can see if I accepted it. Alright. Let's go. So the song is so good, by the way. And I'm guessing the Endwalker song is gonna be just as good. Maybe I'm wrong. Yo, it's me! Wait! Wait! Oh, what are the lore implications? Oh! Wait, hold on, I gotta say hi to everyone. Alright, fuck it, I'm gonna- I'll go! Yo, I'll go! I guess the Paladin's a first-timer too, whatever. I'll main tank if I have to. Nah, I don't think I want to get hit by that. No offense. thing that killed you was a jerk. But you know what? I'm not dead. Yet. I think I might be getting ca uh, carried a little bit by uh, by healers. I'm not totally positive, but I feel like I'm not tanking that badly. Then again, I, I might be. Hopefully the Paladin went to the other group, and not the same group I went to. Stack, stack on me, everyone. <laughs> okay, well there was an attempt. There was an attempt, for sure. Uh, let's do this. This is rough, uh, to say the least. Alright, definitely rough. Not that bad. Not that bad.
Uh, let's get our guy out here. Uh, jump in. Alright, cool. Just, uh, you know, do a million damage. Yeah, apparently. You have all of eternity to show your health bar again. Oh, thanks for resetting the loop. Appreciate it. What is this? Divine Veil? Is that an Astro Scout? I'm gonna do this. Uh, I don't know if it'll help. I'm gonna do it anyway. It's because I don't know. Yeah, this thing's kind of cool. Yo, what the heck? I guess if the other guy's tanking, which I think he is, I can just give, uh, Blackest Knight over. You know, it's all yours, dude. No, don't stand next to me! Alright. That wasn't my fault? Also, I can't see the rest of this, um... <laughs> this, this arena? Uh, let's do this. That probably helps. This boss is so big, like, I, I just can't tell. hit anyway, but, you know. No, it, it's the spirit that matters. I think I want to hit that. You know, the uh, red mage and the healers are on point with the reses. Alright, someone just, uh, that monk just ran off the edge. Don't know how to feel about that. It. Oh, I should have used arm's length. Oh, oh, what's wrong with me? Well, hopefully I get raised.
right? You know, I'm not taking damage, which is what I want to be doing, is not taking damage. Ethereal Gowl. Goal. I think it's a goal. It might be Gowl. I don't know. I could be convinced. I'm sorry for the lack of um, meaningful banter, but I'm really just trying to not throw here as a tank, even though I'm pretty sure at this point. I'm good enough to be carried by these healers. So maybe I shouldn't be worried about it. Holy moly, that definitely killed me, right? Just have to click the button. Yo, 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 click the shit out of that button. Yeah, dude, Heidelin fights Zodiac and wins. Easy flex. See that level three limit break though. Oh yeah. He is making the ground a little bit darker and smaller. I think the idea is we need to kill him before that happens? Uh, let's just, let's just hit him then. Yeah? Yeah. Get out of here. Nice. Boomstones of Allegory. I don't know what those do, because I, uh, you know, haven't gone to the endgame. But... It's good. You hold no power over me. Wait, what did it say? Guess I can't see it. Um, good job, Your name that I'm not gonna pretend I know how to pronounce? I got two comms. Nice. This is definitely the reason you play tank. So you can, uh, get mentor status and have people flame you for being a mentor. Granted, it's probably warranted sometimes. To be fair, I think the reason so many mentors are toxic. Oh, okay, well, I'll get into that later. Why Thancred? Yo, sick backflip? Get Orasite? Here we go. Hmm. 
Yo, that thing is eating the heck out of him. How did you guys get in here? Yo, am I gonna use the blade of light? The axe. Holy shit. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, that was awesome. That was awesome. Wait, we're standing on top of the fake New York, and it's destroyed, but I can see the sky, but we're in, uh, underwater? What's going on right now? What am it, Silk? Remember. Remember us. I think you were right, but I also think you deserved Remember it. Remember that we once lived. Yeah, what happened with the whole uh, dying of light cancer thing? It's over. Emmett Selk is no more. More importantly, how do you fare? Well, you know, in another dimension, I'm a Lollafell, apparently, so. No offense, I'm kind of scarred for life. What dost thou see? Ether. It is. It is as it used to be. As a disciple of Zodiac, the Asian was the darkness to your light. I can but assume that when you set your strength against his, the light within you was spent. No. It's more than that. I don't think this is how this is going Under on. Under the strain of that incredible flood of ether, your soul had begun to break apart. Yet now it seems somehow restored. I tried to help you before the battle, but Emmett Selk stopped me. So, how did you... Exactly what did you... Can you tell us what happened? Remember taxes over there? Yeah, uh, nine me's went into my body. Unfortunately, I think that means I ate them. And they're gone now. Sorry, Lollafell me from another dimension. I appreciate your help. And help from a hero of this world. I see. 
see. Raggedy ass bee. Where to start? A shower? I believe I owe you all an apology. And you, most especially. I'll go ahead and just say my name in the cutscene. Voice acted. It's okay. I'll be here all day. Good to see you awake, bro. <laughs> well, it is good to be awake. <laughs> Why is uh, New York here, and why is it destroyed now? Did, was Emmett Selk just making it look like it wasn't destroyed? And why can I see the sky? Weren't we under the ocean? Oh, I gotta be real with you, I am a little lost. Also, since I was the source of the light, is it gone now? I, uh, yeeted it all at the Asian. So those mad souls dove straight into the ocean over there, did they? Uh, all, all I could see from here was the whale, Master Chai. T'was surely Alpno and those friends of his. They did something heroic, mark my words. You need only look up there for proof of that. It was all Alpha now. say, my love. They're sure to be back any moment now. Any moment. I hope I'm not asking for too much when I say this, but I really want Scholar to get a bit of a rework when the new expat came, so. Man Walker. Oh no, Alpha knows day. Right. Just him though, we're all fine. That's Blue Cat Boy. There, there, look, over there, over the beach. Why am I on the beach? Did the bubble pop? Oh god, did everyone else drown? Oh there! Greetings! You alright? Welcome back! Do I better be able to get a dwarf helmet? Know how to swim. Alpha no. Oh hells. You know, I don't understand. Uh freaking Emmett Selk out here saying you're only one fourteenth of a person. You're actually a loser. Bleh. Actually I think the source is if you're born on the source, you're technically more than one fourteenth of a person, so maybe I'm missing something there, but he'll wash up sooner or later. I can't swim. For the love of no. Probably just tried to teleport back or something. Welcome back! 
I have failed. And I keep getting interrupted in my thoughts, and I, I completely don't remember what I'm saying. The lamps of Amorot will fade along with Emmet Selk's enchantments, and the depths shall be as once they were. Mount Gulg will one day fall, and the Talos below yield to wind and rain. This tale too will if fade just with time, Mount down. passing into legend as the world heals and moves on. Nevertheless. Nevertheless, what? the voice actors what would it be English, Japanese French German probably or maybe English Japanese Spanish Chinese to me that makes the most sense but that's not often the case obeys the cycle as death and decay gives way to new life so too do the memories we share uh -huh. inspire others to rise to greatness I still have to do the mage quest. Those who walk before may lead those who walk after. Your road goes ever on, as does your story, as does your legacy. Don't admit I'm tearing up a bit. Rahatia has a way with words. Such is the hero's lot to touch the lives of countless others. Why am I up here? Excuse me. You're the warrior of darkness, aren't you? You're gonna stab me in the back. I think you do much damage. But... Where are you from, really? And how did you get to be so strong? Wait. Is he supposed to look like Baby Yardbird? It's a secret. <laughs> Whatever. Whatever. I'm not Squall, I promise. Oh, that was awesome. And I guess anything else that comes, I'll record too? Or anything else that I think is important? Oh, that's a sick picture. And the guy in the middle isn't me, but still, it's pretty awesome. I was wearing that armor, I had that sword.
bro. It looks so good. Why was Thancred wearing an eye patch for two expansions? Anyway, yeah, I'll come back uh, when I'm back. Thanks for watching. This will probably be pretty freaking long and will take me forever to upload, but that's okay. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go farm up some Beast Tribe stuff, assuming I'm off the end at this point. See ya. Alright, uh, after the credits, I uh, came back because I'm like, oh, you know what? It still says the mission is Shadowbringers, and I figure I might as well complete the whole mission, right? I knew the knights blessed were amongst the revelers, I, but the Crystarium is so crowded I thought it safe to speak my true name. Poor Runar and his elk are gripped with panic, as you may recall, it is customary not to reveal one's true name outside of family and ceremony. Yet yeah, when I heard to explain that all present were like family, I was greeted with an outpouring of tears and emotional people to bless. Alright. The ending to the tale has been a joyous one indeed, mirroring it with the lessons learned. One particular import. It's imperative that I master magics to grant my feet purchase upon the water or allow, allow it, or else allow me to part the sea at will. I must needs visit Bismarck in due course and scrub his teeth and thanks. I have the airy arts of a fairy whale. Might be imparted to moral men? Mortal men? While I am doing good. We shall see. People came from Malms around to join the festivities, but most seem to have stumbled home by now. Even so, I dare say Norvrant will echo to the sound of clinking mugs for some while yet. I thought to indulge in a little revelry myself last night until Rianger began to list all the names of my drunken conquests. I ended up drinking water. Water. Oh, Elena, are you well? No ill after effects? To my eyes, you seem completely healed. It really is a miracle. Speaking of happy surprises, I was amazed to see the crowd that greeted our return. I hadn't realized just how many people we'd met along the way. Do you see their smiles? Right then and there, I vowed to do whatever I could to keep that joy from fading. It would seem I don't know my own limits. I thought to push on till dawn, but my body had other plans. Still, I did enjoy the carousing even while it lasted. Even I need to forget my cares every now and then. I don't need to wake up to Alphano smirking at my bedside. He said my face was a rare sight while I slept. Gods, I hope I wasn't drooling. It would seem that the city celebrated long into the night. Not that I would know, as embarrassing as it is to admit, I woke to find myself in the infirmary, having apparently collapsed from exhaustion. My aching pride was somewhat soothed by the sight of Alize asleep in the bed next to mine. She must have been just as weary. Long has it been since I've seen her face so peaceful in repose. Ah, uh, t'was a, r a rare, tranquil morning, made unforgettable by the sight of those clear blue skies. By your deeds has the blinding light been banished from these skies, and the Sin Eaters driven to retreat. Although our many hurts will be years in the mending, I have faith that this world and her people will one day be whole once more. With no rejoining in prospect, the Source need no longer fear the coming of an eighth umbral calamity. And with that triumph, the future from which you came will no longer come to pass. Yet here you still stand. Mm. So I do. I wonder if that other age continues onward somehow, cut adrift from time's flow. Or have I simply etched myself a place upon this new block of history? Either way, this is an unexpected development. As the summoner of your souls, my death was meant to release you back to your world. Yet I am very much alive, and you are still stuck here in the first.
I believe I speak for us all when I say that we are happy to postpone our return if it means your life is spared. We will seek out another way. Besides, I never had any intention of rushing home. There are people here I still need to thank, and this means I might actually have time to do so. Yet we dare not neglect our comrades in the source. Mistress Tataru, to name but one, will be most anxious to know how things stand with us. So, you'll just have to make the journey alone for the moment. Be sure and give a full report to our fellow scions, will you? Oh, and we'd also appreciate any news you can bring us from back home. Then I see no reason to delay. I can open the path from here. I imagine we each have matters demanding our attention, so let this be a farewell for us all. Send word when you've resummoned our friend. Oh, and do try to ensure she arrives within the city next time. <laughs> of course. I shall strive for utmost accuracy. No strange forests or unplanned passengers, I promise. Unplanned passengers, hmm? Right, this is going on a little long. It's kind of, it's kind of awkward. Something wrong. I'm a little relieved, to be honest. I would have been terribly lonely Rain. if everyone had suddenly disappeared. Oh yeah, you're from here. But I understand that you have to go. Safe journey, warrior of darkness. I hope to see you again soon. I won't be gone for long. I do have to increase my eye level a lot, though, to do Just any a more content. You in the portal. Then you can be on your way. When I was a boy, many long years ago, I yearned to stand tall as the heroes of Elb. Good foot texture. But like a fool seeking to pluck the stars from the heavens, my every attempt to reprise their deeds fell short. And then one day, an all but forgotten dream from my youth stood before me in the flesh. I still don't get it. There's so many characters in this game that have open-toed shoes and you're gonna give me that? and beyond and saw I knew not what. All I knew was that I would give anything to stand at that hero's side. Sorry, you can't go through. Good that it was so easy. The glory of the heavens was ever beyond the grasp of those who never thought to reach for it. But if I have gained anything from all of this, it is the courage to stretch out my hand. Do you hear me, Rahatia? This is no time for sleeping.
Oh, good. We're gonna get to see some Austinian action. Here we go. These weapons really are extra beyond the belief. <laughs> To the west gate. I want to know what's happening there. Same as the others. Struck down with a single blow. An unfortunate day to draw guard duty. Is this Xenos? Forgive me. These were your people. We took advantage of this slaughter to slip into the palace. It is not for me to grieve them. Why is Gaius so cool? That was the Emperor. Wait! Like he was kinda not cool and then he was cool. Xenos kill the Emperor. Your radiance! Not quite. Gaius. You've missed your part in this, I'm afraid. How did he get his body back? for the Asian. The Craven shed this skin and fled rather than face me. A pity. I was looking forward to crossing blades with myself. But I cannot deny the feeling of satisfaction. Body and soul reunited at last. The game continues, but the pieces have changed. Only if we trust in Paragon's words. A mistake I do not intend to repeat. How come every, like, main character's hair is white in this game? Was a second life not enough? What's the Empire too rich a prize to ignore? Through freedom for our nation, our people will never be won by a spoiled princeling. The burden of this throne is beyond you. Hmm. Tis you, father, who have struggled with this burden. Simply holding the Empire together has occupied your limited faculties. But you may take comfort in knowing that I have no intention of pursuing your tedious agenda. Nor am I interested in ruling over the Empire's lands. I came only to remove that which ruins my sport. I will not have my prey stolen by your petty wars and cowardly weapons.
You would kill me just for that. I need no other reason. Any and all who interfere with my hunt. Damn. Will not do so twice! Xenos, you crazy I heard the Asians speak of Zodiac, an island. Even the will of this star is but a construct of our own making. We shall gorge upon their strength, and then, my friend, our contest shall begin anew. Oh, guys, if you die here, that'd be a real waste. Waste of a cool character that uh, I haven't really interacted with at all. Oh, man. Okay. Some crazy stuff is happening. We're not done with the uh, quest, though. Going to the Rising Stones and talking to Tantaru. Then we'll be done. Holy moly, though. It's insane. Also, insanely hot. Too. Uh, when I'm done, I'm gonna open some. I sweat a little less. Yeah, I won't cut out that screen. Why bother, Rick? Oh, okay, just no one was loaded in yet. Like, what's going on? Hello, Tataru. It's gonna ignore me. But, 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 Lena, is it really you? Yo. But how? When? We didn't think you'd be back for ages. Time moves in mysterious ways. Right, so, so it does. The reports you had delivered by that excitable little pixie said as much. As for the situation on this side, the Imperials are still eyeing our forces from afar. From what I'm told, the Garlean armies have been slow to react and seem reluctant to commit any large-scale engagements. On sort of stalemate. Otherwise, we've yet to see any sign of that awful Black Rose weapon we were warned about. Oh, but I suppose we did call in an old friend to help out on that account. Hehe, <laughs> Kryl and I had a terrible time tracking him down, though. It'll be worth to see the look on your face when you find out who it is. Anyway, I was just about to make contact with the cell phone of ours and then confirm the latest news from the front. Might you fancy having a rest while I do? Ah, the Warrior of Light, back where she belongs, just as if nothing had happened. Though you do seem different somehow, you'll have to tell me all about your adventures when we next have a spare moment. Until then, welcome back. Yeah, I've got like 10 people inside of me. You know, some might find that to be a uh, pleasurable experience, but not me. Oblivion has claimed him. Uh, 
Hermit Selk gone, Labre gone. I remain the last of the unbroken. Once more, I move to reevaluate the potential of these tattered souls. Ah, Xenos, never did I dream you could overpower me so completely. Possessed as I was of your body, and all its uncanny strength. That I shared with you the truth of this world and its reflections. Who can predict how an events will unfold? Not I. Litibus is the nerd Asian, right? Emissary, what a poor jest that title has become. The flow of history has become muddied. Its currents wild beyond my capacity to direct them. You have wrested the advantage, Hydaelyn. The thieving hands of your disciples tighten their grip on our star. The origins of the world remain hidden and its inhabitants ignorant of their broken existence, just as you and your creators desired. Celebrate the gift of imperfect life, uncaring, unknowing as we weaken something. He's a fast talker. As we weaken and fade, but do not imagine yourself rid of us, though your champion has indeed proven the most egregious obstacle to our ascendance. A barbed thorn on my side, she may yet be removed and cast into the abyss. Oh yes, it can be done. I will keep these heroes mired in the first, and victory will be ours at the last. Warriors of darkness now, are they? Then their fate is decided. They shall meet the same and end as those who came before, death at the hands of the warriors of light. Oh, I'm blind. Ow. It seems you were right. Yes, there is something out there. But it would mean crossing moms and moms of this infernal emptiness, which is rather unhealthy for living creatures, as I understand. If we were to restrict ourselves to brief forays, I don't like to imagine the effect it would have on our ether. But you still want to go, don't you? May have saved the world, but we haven't reclaimed it. When you put it that way. What choice do we have? Well, of course I'm going with you. That's what family's for, isn't it? Come, let's head back and prepare for this mad journey of yours. Thank you, Thoncred. Thoncred. Uncreed. I know pronouncing things wrong on the internet gets you, uh, laid. Even though that's really just how I'm saying it, and it's not like I don't know how it's actually pronounced. Though blazing skies give way to gentle night, what hand can end the war of dark and light? Lead of Shadowbringers. Trust interface under duty. You can repeat SQ with a party of NPCs. Guess I'll figure that out later. Oh. New job quests? Okay, lots of stuff. Lots of stuff happening. 
All right, now it's the end, though. Oh, oh, oh man, I've been sitting here forever. <laughs> oh, man, that was sick, though. Okay. I'm looking forward to what happens next. Um, yeah, if you are, too, maybe uh, sub, and you'll be able to see it with me. Uh, bye.